What's up guys welcome back to another Dragon Ball Super this is 127 let's go ahead and hit play and see what Jiren has to offer I did not like what he did uh, in the last episode okay we're gonna skip that 45 seconds alright people it's 45 let's go ahead and hit play I did really not like what he said you know to Topo when he said I expected more than you you are worthless etc etc so I was like I mean, I thought Jiren was a good guy. It's going to be finally a fight between a good guy and a good guy. But, you know, I'm pretty sure he's probably good, but he care about strength a lot. But Goku's the same thing. He's a good guy. He care about the strength, but he's not like that. I mean, like you worthless. I expected more from you. But oh well. But I hope that wasn't the Vegeta's final moment, honestly, because he's, I know he won't have any energy left, but he can recover, right, if Goku was able to fight, because Jiren seems like he's going to power up, and that is not a good news for anybody, at least for Junior 7. So if Jiren power up, that's just, that's just going to be bad. So they, they need Vegeta and Goku have to fight together. I don't know, let's see who's gonna get knocked out at this time. And also for the Seven Deadly Sins, I know the episode is out, but I can't find a sub version of the uh, episode. So if you do find it, do let me know in the comment section. Give me the link, I will go and check it out, okay? Anyway, let's go. Okay, so we're getting a preview. Yep, it is at its climax. Yeah, that's actually, you know, that's a good point where Vegeta showed, like, he became strong for somebody, like, protecting somebody, where Topo gave up everything. Even the thing he really believed. Dude, that moment was epic, though, I'm not gonna lie. I really don't think this is Vegeta's final power-up. But he's about to show you something, guys. There we go. I know. Well, Goku, you know, powering up. Uh, Ultra Instinct. Basically, give him equal of before Jiren fight. But now, let's see how that's going to change. Because that's going to be a big difference, right? There we go. I told you this anti gravities. Look at that. Look at that. This guy is monster to the core, man. Oh damn, this guy is sun itself, like literally the sun, he is on fire people, <laughs> he is on fire, Sukoine, <laughs> whew, See, I told you now Vegeta need to recover and come back and fight together with Goku. That's that's the only way I see them defeating Jiren. But that's not his only power up. But I don't, well, at least that's what I'm thinking. I don't. I think he can still go higher. Oh damn! Dude, 
they all going at him together. Dude! This is not even funny. He dodge all three of them and attack one of them at the same time. With the power of now you can see the difference. Before Vegeta and Goku was fighting him equally. Now number 17 joined in. So all three of them basically combined that new power up. So that's just... Oh, okay. It seems like... Oh, okay. Never mind. If he feel like it, he can still attack them, not only defend. Damn, what? Oh. It's like a crossfire. Dude, this guy literally released fire. Damn, but number 17 made a good choice though. If anybody has a chance, this has to be Goku and Vegeta together. So, because he knows they can still power up. At least that's what I think. Oh damn, the skull pincer attack people. Whew. He's like, okay, nah, I have to break this. He sent Jiren, I mean, Goku, Vegeta back. Goku comes. Oh my god, so many names just rolling. Rolling? Rolling out of my mouth. Okay, who's that? That's a Frieza? Oh no, wait, where the hell is Frieza? Dude, that's like a literally fire. Mm. I'm sure he did. He is about to say fire fist, but yeah. Look at that. Man is a walking volcano. Okay. He just made a shield up with his key. Damn. Okay, Goku need to go Ultra Instinct. Vegeta need to go to Ultra Instinct to see his past. You know, we have to... It's hard to go past him, man. I mean, it's just, it's just hard. Yeah, he is unbelievable. Okay, what's... Why Topo seems under surprise? I don't know, I'm getting goosebumps, people. Topo is like, hmm... I'm surprised. He didn't notice uh, number 17. Wait, he didn't do self-destruction, did he? No, it's not self-destruction, but did he get into the blast as well, number 17? I bet Jiren probably will have like two lines on his back. That's pretty much it. I, it to make it worse, he can be perfectly fine. Oh, look at that. So he got blasted in the opposite direction. Let's see. You don't probably standing like that. It's nothing happened. What did you do? Oh, okay. Okay, and that's more more damage than I expected. Damn, Jiren is so pissed. He's so pissed. Good job, number 17. I swear to God, that's a, that's a bloody good job. Oh, damn. Okay, the fighting genius got an, got an idea, people. <laughs> Vegeta literally, I think it's he, he. I think Vegeta is, you know, using his life force as an energy man. I mean, look at him. Oh, damn. 
Oh damn. Oh okay, break. Dude, that first half was so fast because it's that interesting. Trust me, they, I didn't even think it's like 10 minutes or something worth. Oh damn, the intense. <laughs> okay, they first blind his eye. But Jiren don't even use his eye, does he? Okay, now Vegeta and Goku are fighting him equally. I think number 17 is gonna charge up and come back. Well, that's the plan anyway, let's see. Ooh! That was a big hit though. But wait, what happened now? Ooh! Dude, look at the amount of production layer he had. It's all been destroyed into nothing. Ooh! Dude, I swear to God, he, oh my God. I was about to say he better have at least one scratch. Look at him. He's like, mm, he's sitting like an egg. Okay, I think he's at his limit. I think he can focus so much. I mean, he can't focus that much. Ooh. Okay, never mind. I think he just reflected all of the attack. Dude, technically they don't have to defeat him if you think about it. All they have to do is stay in the stage and they will win. Okay? But as a pride, Goku and Vegeta, you know what they're obviously gonna do. So. But that's what normally the problem, like, right, with, like we said, when they are attacking coordinately, these guys normally have a problem. Oh shit! Oh ho 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 ho! That is so unexpected from Freezer. He's not even Golden Freezer. Look at his eyes! Dude, that is so unexpected from Freezer. This episode is full of surprises. I literally have goosebumps. But he's gonna try to kill him. Okay, Golden Freezer is here. Ooh. Dude! Okay, I think Freezer got Oh, never mind. He didn't get knocked down. But his eye. Okay, number 17. I think number 17 is gonna get knocked down. I don't know why. I just have this feeling he's gonna get knocked down this time. He have a lot of energy, I agree with that, but still. Okay, why is he asking that question? That's how, that's how simple his plan is. Are they wasting time on, you know, purpose? It was so action packed, it's all just slow down, like, <laughs> stop. Oh, damn. Oh, okay. So we're going to. Oh, Jiren's passed. Interesting. evil door and he saw them dying wait is that like a previous god of destruction or something
Oh, okay. Oh. Oh shit. Yeah, that's why he's like more like emotional. Oh damn. He's pissing him off in, on purpose, I, I, I know that much, but at the same time, his points are pretty good actually, you know, they are true. He's not interested in taking any of the advice though. Alright Goku, we know you have strength, get up man! <laughs> Ah, uh, come on, Vegeta, don't bullshit me. Come on, get up. Oh, damn. Okay, this, this is, seems like some intense attack. Dude, that's a mini sun just going toward them. Come on, Goku, man. Wait, what now? Dude, don't let number 17 do all the hard work, man. I mean... Then get the hell up! Dude, but number 17 know who, who's the, you know, possible candidate to beat them. You know, respect though, number 17, respect. Oi! <sighs> I swear, number 17 is just pure badass, man. I, that is not something I expected to see this character returning after a long time. You know, I was surprised by his trend, but. Yeah, this is something I unexpected. Dude, half of the stage is just... If he, he... He won't kill him. Wait, where's number 17? He didn't come here. Nah, that's not happening, but where's number 17? You know, I don't care about those two right now because they are taking a rest. Okay, he's still alive. What the, where the hell is he?
Where is he? He is not dead, right? He can't be dead because Jiran would be disqualified. Wait, what? So that doesn't basically disqualify him. Ah, uh, come on, really now? Dude, this is messed up. Dude, this is, this is just not, no, no. <sighs> really, really not liking what they did here. It's a big surprise, but really not liking what they did here. That's really unexpected. I did, I honestly didn't expect somebody to die, especially when they said if they die, you know, other person will get disqualified. But this is a self destruction. I didn't think. I did. I totally didn't think about that. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think, guys. I mean, this is a big surprise for me. I. It was the first half was full of action packs. So I really enjoyed it, but then second half, we got to see Jiren's past, and then this. I don't know, it was, it's just, it's just, nah. I don't like it, but again, that's something they like to do. Surprise, for example, Gohan getting defeated and stuff. Because Gohan, you normally wouldn't expect Gohan to defeat, get defeated. But this time, number 17 took Gohan's place, I guess. And then Frieza, that was surprising too, when he came and knocked down Jiren. At least landed a few kicks and stuff in there. But, yeah, he also got kicked again. We're not going to look at the preview. Let me know your thoughts, your reaction in the comment section. If you did enjoy this episode, you can vote by going to the top right hand corner. And also, if you did enjoy the video, you can leave a like. If you are new, don't forget to subscribe. That's it for me, people. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a wonderful day and see you guys with more videos.